Hi guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm very excited for this one. I'm going to be using my favourite fighter at the moment in real life and on the game, Shavka Rachmanov. So, don't know if I've said his name correctly, Shavka, but he is an absolutely phenomenal fighter. I do think he is better than Hamzat Chemaev. He just doesn't have the star power yet, but believe you me this man will i think he's 16 fights now 16 finishes he's absolutely nothing short of phenomenal i think his last fight was against neil magny and i cannot wait to see where this man goes and i'm so happy he's been added to the game because then i can bring you gameplay clips and show you you know exactly how to use him how to utilize him and i hope you guys enjoy this video it's going to be my first one in about seven eight days i got really really ill again just after i got better i got really ill and i just haven't had the time to do a voiceover um my throat's been killing i had this cold going around england that's been you know terrorizing everyone up and down the country but now i am fortunately feeling much much better and i cannot wait to showcase you guys uh Shavka. i hope you really enjoyed this video i really enjoyed making it and here was one of my first fights using him i believe um I'm not entirely sure but you can see i'm getting pieced up by the leon edwards here and i'm going to tell you straight that throughout this video you'll just see a combination of gameplay clips and you'll see me sleeping people i got my best knockout ever using Shavka, and i think that's the next gameplay clip and it's in a mirror match and you will see me putting people to sleep with submissions. You know I'm a submission specialist and that's exactly what I like to go for. And you'll see me getting submissions that I don't usually get, which is uh, quite interesting. Everyone knows that I go for the Kimura from side control. Um, but you'll see a wide range uh, of more submissions, not necessarily um, arm bars and Kimuras. But nevertheless, it was a very fun video to make and I hope you guys enjoy. I just want to say a huge thank you for all the support as per usual over 440 subscribers which is absolutely crazy and i can't thank you guys enough i know you enjoyed the last video a lot which was how to get takedowns as you see i go for the necktie here um so yeah just big thank you to you guys keep doing what you guys are doing if you keep enjoying the content don't forget to leave a like and if you're new subscribe for more ufc4 content i will try to push more content out regularly but yeah getting into the gameplay here you saw what happened i saw he had no stamina and i go for the necktie and you'll see that i do end up finishing it off and now shavka is so versatile i mean on the feet is absolutely phenomenal i mean the array of striking that he has only downside being his switch stance being 80 and i feel like his recovery is a little bit off it's not as good as it says it is but please just watch this knockout this is phenomenal i mean the timing on this i think i'm gonna have to put this on twitter because it is nothing short of amazing and the guy sends me a hate message after just hold your breath for this one bang oh, that is absolutely monstrous i don't care what anybody says that is time to absolute perfection and that was with a mirror match so it was unfortunate to get a mirror match, but he's not used too often um, from what I did notice. I played about six or seven games with him and only had one mirror match, which is good. So he can be my main and I don't have to worry about anything else. I was trying to get the judo throw there because that's something that he has in his arsenal that's very, very good. You can see I'm against Stephen Thompson here and I've done good work when it comes to leg kicks. And I do prioritize being careful with my leg health. You can see there my left leg is pretty much done. And with his switch stance being 80, you do have to be very, 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 very careful because there's some absolute killers in this division if they get your leg health down they're just going to tear away at you so you can see putting the pressure here beautiful slip uppercut um get the finish here jump on top and you can see get him out of there with ground and pound so i do face a wide range of opponents i think i come up against leon edwards twice um not sure if i come up against the colby covington or any of those sorts of names we've got thompson there we come up against rda which is very respectable because i like using rda myself but i just feel so confident when i'm using him i mean I just try and re replicate what he does in real life, and that's very hard to do. I'm also not loving the gameplay at the moment. It feels like they definitely changed something. I don't know what it is, but I'm just not enjoying how the game feels. But I'm just super happy that they've added some, you know, new fighters. I will be getting around to using the others, but of course, like I said, Shafka being my favourite fighter, I have to uh, utilise him first, and I will be getting more gameplay with him. So if you guys smash the likes and um, let me know in the comments that you want to see more, I will upload more gameplay with him because I love using him. And you can see here the RDA has rocked me and that's where I was saying the recovery is a bit skewered. I do feel like he doesn't recover as well as his stats do say, which is very bizarre considering that, you know, he's never lost. He's got a 100% finish rate as well. But you can see what I have done a good job of is absolutely melting RDA stamina and we go for the necktie again. So throughout the video you'll see this is a common theme. I've started using it more often. 
um, the necktie. I've started trying to diversify the submissions I do go for. I mean, this mini game's a lot harder than the other one, to be honest with you, and it's a lot harder to get submission attempts. But where the divisions just reset and you know the skill-based matchmaking's a bit uh, off because you know people that are in division 20 usually starting off in division five, etc. So you're coming up against a bigger skill gap when it comes to opponents. So maybe that's why I'm getting these submissions a bit easier. But I don't want to take the credit away from myself because. It is very, very good work. And here coming up against Leon Edwards again. And I think I play out most of this round. So you see that Leon takes me down here, which is kind of crazy. Um, I don't see Leon doing this in real life if they fight. But yeah, the Leon Edwards player takes me down. I'm very comfortable off my back. Like, he's so good on the ground. Like, he's actually a joke how good this man is on the ground. He just feels effortless. I mean, you can trans transition from striking to grappling beautifully and he's got a phenomenal judo throw which i try to utilize which does get denied a lot because it is quite easy to deny but when it does play off you know it's just very smooth and looks very nice i would say the best way to use him is to really mix up the striking and the grappling he does have some fancy kicks which i need to display uh, more when i do another showcase for him because you know that taekwondo background i believe that he has he has very very good kicks i mean look at that transition there straight to half guard phenomenal but he has very very good transitions and um very good kick in arsenal which i didn't utilize too too much i was focused on being keeping it a bit more simple and breaking down my opponents um you can see leon gets to the sprawl position here he tries to go up get a good deny and you know exactly what i'm going for and i lock in another one which is absolutely fantastic so the video is going to come to an end soon i hope you guys did enjoy like i said earlier on in the video if you did leave a like and subscribe if you are new also, if you have any content suggestions, let me know in the comments below. I will work around it. I'll reply to all comments. I absolutely love the feedback from you guys. So anything, let me know. If you want any games, whatever it is, let me know in the comments below. And I think there's one more gameplay clip coming up here, and it will be ending. So this is another beautiful knockout against Ham, um, Chumayev, Hamza Chumayev. And this finish is nasty. Bang. <laughs> Putting people to sleep. So hope you guys enjoyed this, and I will catch you next time. Thank you for all the support. Bye.